Oh my god, I am so excited for this game. Diamond was my first ever Pokemon game, and the remakes are finally out. Oh, that menu sound was so nostalgic. Oh, the menu set the ah! They haven't even started, and it's already just all coming back. Oh, I'm so excited. Oh, oh, you get okay. You can customize it. That's cool. Well, I'm gonna go with you know how I was back when I initially played. We get to name the rival. It's been so long since we've been able to name the rival. What did I name him when I first played? That was his name. Yeah, we're, we're nostalgia maxing today. I'm using the exact same, well, I guess not the exact same names as when I first played. Because I named myself Siliker, which is not, it's not a name I had back then, but whatever. I was like eight when I got this game or something. Oh, it's Red Gyarados! It's Red Gyarados! I get the reference! Jubilee TV. Oh, it's been so long. I'm gonna, <laughs> I'm gonna pop off over every little thing. Twin Leaf Town music. Hold on a second. Oh, no potion in the PC. All right. Oh, every little sound bite. This is so sweet. Ah. Uh. <laughs> you just kind of clip in just like how it used to be. You have to hit A now, but you know what? That's fine. Oh, that's nostalgic. Getting, you know, bodied by our rival whenever we try to enter an area. The one million pokey fine. Oh, you'll love to see it. I don't have a camera, but I'm, I'm just smiling. Oh, this is so great. I followed you home. <laughs> what now? <laughs> oh, every new song is there's gonna be a little moment where I'm just gonna have to wait and listen, huh? Oh, it's so great. Oh my God, we get to hear Lake theme next. But like, I don't want to stop listening to this one. But like, I also want to listen to Lake theme. Ah! <laughs> Was he away in four years in the original? I don't remember. So I wonder how much, if at all, they've changed the main, the original story. Because like, I know when Oras came out, they had a bunch of changes, you know, for Mega Evolution and etc. But I don't know if they're changing as much in this game. Oh, and the briefcase. All right, so I'm gonna pick the same one as my very first time, and that was Chimchar. I even knew he was front and center, too. Wild Pokemon battle, let's go. Ah, oh, the music's so nostalgic. Oh, I'm so happy just to be playing this game. Okay, and our rival picks the, strong, the one strong against us, so we actually have a tough rival this time. Running shoes, I can run! Tilt the left stick firm. Oh, it's not like holding B, it's like dashing in Smash Bros. Okay, that's that's kind of weird, because now I can't really just walk. Oh, it's not, okay, so I just, I just hold it all the way and I'm automatically running. Look at me go, mom. I'm a rambunctious little baby boy. But if I want to walk, I just kind of, I, I still just kind of walk faster. I, I, got, I got a little pep in my step, you know what I mean? You give me a potion, right? Yup. Wait, potions? Oh, you got a buff, huh? How many do you give me? Ten po- Ten potions! For free! Amazing. I'm gonna try and recreate my original team that I had my first playthrough, and uh, I'm not gonna catch any Pokemon except for the ones that I had on my original team. Pokemon may be easy, but you can definitely do some things to make it a little harder on yourself other than Nuzlocke. Avoiding wild encounters, which is not what I'm doing right now just because I want to hear the battle music. Also, just not having a full team at all times can make the game a little bit harder, and that's what I'm gonna do. Every song is like another punch of nostalgia in the gut. I didn't think it'd be this bad. I knew I was gonna get nostalgic, but I didn't realize just how every single song was gonna be, you know, another punch. What do we nickname him? I never had nicknames in my original playthrough, so I really don't know. I don't know what to name Chimchar. We need to name Chimchar though, you know, for a little personal attachment. But I can't think of any names. I think I, ha I used Infernape for comp a little while, like, 
ages ago. And I think I just named it Guy Fieri. No, I named it Guy Ferrari because I didn't know how to spell Fieri. And I honestly thought it was Guy Ferrari. That's funny, right? Guy Ferrari. I don't know how to spell Ferrari. And you know what? I'm just going to guess because that's funny. Am I happy with that nickname? Honestly, no. But yeah, I'm, that's what I'm doing it. Don was willing to throw hands. So is... Is the Pokemart- It's a separate building again! Oh, wow! Ever since Gen 5, it's always been in the same building, but they're bringing it back or it's separate. I'm 10 years old and have a Pokemon. I have to leave you. I'm sorry. Wait, where's my hat? Yeah. Yeah. There's the hat. Oh, you get, you get the side view? Giving us the angles? You gotta show off the hat, you know? Even the door sound just gives me at least a little bit in this- wait. Shop music. I was gonna talk, but now I'm here to listen to shop music. Man, Gen 4- I'm playing Gen 4 remakes! Let's just let that set in for a second. These are Gen 4 remakes, and I'm currently playing them. Oh, we gotta catch a Pokemon. Can you like menu a little faster, please? So I said I was gonna try and recreate my original team. And I know there's all the memes about, oh, I'm gonna make a new Gen 4 team. It's the exact same. Cause there's the one team that everyone used. I did not use that team. I was a stupid kid. My team was really weird. And I will reveal them when the time comes. But believe it or not, none of them are on this route. Trainer battle. Oh, the transition! That's straight from the DS! Oh, I love it! Quick attack. Come. Critical! Come on! So it outspeeds. And, uh. Uh oh. Alright. I, I don't want to have to use uh, items mid battle, but uh, it's, you know. You know? Okay, so. Now we go heal because we can. Definitely not because I'm feeling threatened by almost losing to the first trainer at all. Definitely not that. So as I said, one of the ways to make the game harder is you don't get to grind off of uh, wild battles. You just run from them. So yeah, we're just fighting trainer battles. I'll beat up the preschoolers. Think I won't. We're good. Don't worry. I have plot armor. I can't lose. Oh, so, I wasn't paying attention to, okay, so, huh, so I was right, I'm, that's what I'm saying, it makes it a little harder if you wait to catch Pokemon, you know, things become a little more difficult, it's, it's called difficulty modification, I got beat up by the preschooler, oh yeah, that's right, the first gym is a rock gym, huh, and I am stuck with Chimchar, right, oh, but you can still move around with it, that's cool, wait, hold on, this is a good game. The first Pokemon we will be catching is coming up. I'm gonna get some training though, because I've gotta get ready for the rock type gym with my fire type Pokemon. You know, it's not gonna be easy, so we've gotta level up. We've gotta do some training against, so you gotta fight every single trainer, get as many levels up as I can, and hope for the best. All right, so I think the first Pokemon we're getting is in here, actually. There he is. So one of the Pokemon I had on my original team was Golem. And so we have to catch Geodude. So it's level five, right? Like, I could just do this, right? Amazing. And we're gonna do an unoriginal joke, I think. It just seems easy. So I'm a little worried about the Orbo... Or... I never knew how to pronounce that sound name, I'll be honest. The first gym. The rock gym. Because, uh, I have a fire type and a rock type. And the rock type doesn't even know rock moves, but not that it would matter because it still gets resisted by the rock types. He gets power up part. <gasps> okay, never mind. We get to we get to win against the gym challenge. We get a fighting type move. <laughs> this wasn't a move back in Gen 4, but hey, now he gets power up punch, which makes the gym fight a lot easier. I was thinking, oh, I'll just have to randomly catch him and chop and go back on my whole thing of I'm only gonna catch the Pokemon I'm gonna use. But you know, if it's just gonna give me power up punch, then I think we're good. I remember as a kid, I always like. Geodude was- why would you use Geodude dude? you could have Onyx, right? Like, Onyx is just Geodude, but like, he's cool and big, so 
clearly he's better. So yeah, the rock types aren't really proving an issue, which is great. Power up punch definitely makes this easier. All right, it's time for our first gym battle with uh, qu quite an interesting strategy. We are going to use the fire type and it's gonna work, I promise. Oh, he got the cut-ins, that's, that's cool. Just like in the original. So you're not gonna use rock moves, right? You're just gonna like defense curl perhaps. Maybe a tackle if you're feeling real antsy. Okay, no, he has rolled out. Understood. Um, so by the way, the strategy doesn't work. Unless that end is okay, so bye. Is there no <gasps> Oh! Oh, never mind, we're good! We clutch these! We clutch these! Level 14, you love to see it. Get the attack bonus mid-fight. Alright, we just gotta deal with Onyx. Oh no, we have, he has two more, okay. I don't wanna switch out because then I lose my attack up. Cause I'm like plus three at the moment. And that's really good. But I also really wanna heal because I'm sure Onyx is just gonna kill me outright. We're gonna use a potion, see what damage he decides to do, and then make a decision from there. Stealth Rock. Okay, cool. Thanks for giving me the free heal turn. Rock there, I can take that. We take those. All right, one more guy left. I don't care about your rock types. I ha I can punch you. Crane dose. All right, I'm gonna do the same thing. I'm gonna heal, be safe. I know I don't I don't usually like to use items in mid battle, but if I can beat this with Chimchar, I'm feeling pretty good. I don't care if I have to use potions. See what he wants to do. Headbutt. That's not a rock move. It still hurts. All right, I'm gonna maybe he decides to do something else. You know. Maybe you don't, he doesn't want to headbutt this time. No, he does something worse. Alright, alright. So, here's the play, I think. Cranidos is slow, I can get one power-up punch off. And then, I go all in with Geodude. Why does he outspeed? Cranidos is slow! That's its whole thing! It's slow! Why am I outsped by everything ever? We'll see what Rollout does. And we'll see what Bulldoze does. I'm mad. Well, I've learned nothing and will proceed to do the exact same thing again. Hey, maybe you don't use Rollout this time? Okay, yeah. Uh, I kind of wanted that free turn with Onyx, but whatever. I'm cool with that. All right, yes, give me the free turns. Give me the free turns. So, we're leveled up now. Maybe now we outspeed Cranidos, you know? We outspeed! Ah! Let's go! I told you it would work. I don't care if I have just... <laughs> I did the exact same thing as last time and it worked enough because I'm leveling up. And if it didn't work, I would have just evolved the next time because I was about to level up again. Or maybe I level up now or evolve now. Let's go, Bidoof. So I like that even if you don't have Bidoof, Bidoof is still de the designated HM slave. I just think that's funny. Oh! We have Mew. It just gave us Mew and Jirachi. So, uh, I think I'm not going to use them, actually. It just seems a little unfair if I were to, you know? Okay, so that's how you get more stickers, or one way to get more stickers. Unfortunately, I have absolutely no berries except for the cherry berry I was just given. Oh, wait, I can steal their berries. That's something I can do. This dude's really out here trying to conquer the world with a worm pole. And you know what? All the power to him. I respect it. Okay, Silcoon in the 3D games just doesn't have the spikes, but like, it originally did. And I want to know where the heck those spikes went. Why is it just a ball now? You used to be cool, man. Again, Cascoon also doesn't have spikes, and I want to understand where they were. Where they? Where are they? What the heck? So it's nice and convenient that they all have bug types, so I can just one-shot everything. I feel bad for people who picked Turtwig, especially because I'm pretty sure Mars at the end here has uh, poison types. Chibi Mars. I was only like 80% sure I got the name right, and I'm very happy to see I did get it right. So I'm thinking of the Pokemon that I'm gonna have on my team. I'm realizing we're not gonna get another one for a while, actually, but that's fine. Monferno and Geodude, they're gonna stick it together till the end. That's mean, and you didn't have to do that. Wait, it's not doing damage. 
Does poison not do damage out of battle now? Really? I'm kind of upset. You know, like they kind of made it soft. And that's whatever, but... Eh. It means you can't unpoison a Pokemon by bringing it to one health and then healing it with a potion. I used to do that in the Elite Four all the time. Piplop. You're not allowed to have a starter. That's illegal. You stole that. Eterna Forest. Oh yeah, and we get a little buddy for this section. So they have the Mossy Rock. They brought back the old way of evolving Eevee. Because, like, they changed it to only using an Ice Stone or a Leaf Stone, which is kind of lame. But I think they changed it back. One of them has three. And the other one's just there with one Pokemon. So if we just take out Pachirisu, it's a 2v1. And I think that's funny. And it's a 2v1 against a Bug Trader, so I get... I get to one-shot everything. Spikeless Silcoon looks so cursed. I do not like it. It just has a bad aura about it, you know? Alright, so if I can I hit- if I just talk to one... Do I only fight one? You can skip the double battles just like you used to be able to do, that's insane. I can't believe they kept that in. THERE'S THE SPIKES! THEY EXIST! I KNEW THEY EXISTED! I KNEW I WASN'T BEING GASLIT! WHY ARE THEY RETRACTABLE? It's not right! You got a magic cart. Oh! Oh, he's got a gold deed! That's different! That's different! Now this is a fight! He's got flying moves! They do no damage, but it's still, like, uh, is super effective, technically. Oh, he's got- This guy's got six Magikarps, if I remember correctly. This guy's really just the Magikarp gauntlet. Which, you know what? You have to respect a man who commits so hard to have six Magikarps. Maybe he's not gonna be the gr the greatest trainer out there, but you got- You can respect it, right? He's going places. Not to gyms, not to the Pokemon League, but he's going somewhere. Underground man's house. We can go underground now. Yeah, that'll be a good joke. Oh, it's huge. Oh, wow. <laughs> I'm so happy doing this again. God, it's so nice and nostalgic just hearing the underground theme again. Just, ah, I love it. This is effectively the wild area. Like, to an extent, it's not the exact same. Clearly. Well, that's something I was wondering because everyone likes the wild area in Gen 8. And I was wondering if they were going to try and do some form of that in the remakes. And this, I guess, is their answer to that. Okay, that's not fair. He was hidden. Ooh, volcanic cave. Actual fire types, maybe? In in the volcano cave? Fire types in Sinnoh? Mate, no. Nope. Fire types are illegal in Sinnoh, actually. Um, except for the two. So even in the volcanic cave, you will still not find any fire types. Anyways, back to playing the game. Do we get a bike? Yet? I don't remember. I don't remember if I can just walk in and get a bike. All oh, right, I have to get him out of the galactic building. Well, I can get a gym badge, and I think that's what I'm gonna do. Oh, I, I really have to search for him, huh? Oh, they made this difficult, huh? Like, honestly, at this point, why don't I just burn down the forest inside the gym, you know, and just reveal him? That's one way to find him, right? I'm just problem solving. It's not arson, officer. It's problem solving. I don't even need to heal poison. I'm not even worried. I didn't take any damage at all during those fights. I just one-shot everything. I'm not even gonna heal. It's not? Y you don't think so? I mean, I guess it's not. There is still another turn. Ooh, actually, it's only one level below. And it outspeeds. It gets to fight. It gets to attack me. Look at it go. It's putting up a fight. Never mind. I changed. Nope. Never mind. I take back everything I said. Well, that's two gym badges. Oh, oh, fear! Chibi Cynthia be like, haha, I am a terrifying trainer, fear me. Can I just, like, have this laptop? I can take it and just, you know, give it to the police, probably. And um, let them know what's up. You know, just, just, just take this laptop. Come on. I'm pressing the A button and it's not picking up the laptop. We can solve so many problems. If we just take this laptop, no one's even guarding it. I could leave right now. All right. I'm a 10-year-old boy. I don't know that. I don't know what laptops do. What's a computer? Oh, we don't get Galactic theme. He's just a dude. This guy, this guy's not even re related to Team Galactic. He just kind of walked in and no one's really called him out on it. Y'all have this scientist guy who just kind of came in. I, f I figured I should let you know. Um, I don't- I don't think he's meant to be here. Thank you for bringing this to my attention. In return, I will give you the bike manager. You'll give me a bike now, right? 
Yeah. He's got one personality trait, and it's that he owns a bike. Oh my god, I forgot that the cycling road is like angled, so you're always going down if you release. I thought my, my controller was drifting for a second, but no. It's not drift, it's a game mechanic. But like actually unironically, because it did that in the DS too. This will decide the fate of the universe. You see, actually, secretly, this is like Undertale, where every decision has a, has disastrous consequences. So this will decide the fate of who dies and who lives. This could kill Pikachu, like all of them. Versus Seeker, we're seeking out Pikachu. Uh, Cyrus looks a little... <laughs> different in chibi form. It's Ryu. Ryu is my favorite Pokemon. I'm sorry, this just looks like- is, I know it's supposed to be a, like a, a baby in a stroller, but it just looks like a dude in a stroller. Because everyone looks small, so like... It doesn't really look that small. At most, it looks like an eight-year-old kid. Rival battle. Oh my god, I forgot all about how he would always spam double team. That was his whole strategy, is that he used a double team. Thank god I one-shot him, because I do not want to deal with that. Actually, this could be an issue. Yeah, this could be an issue. You know what, I'll take the L on this. And give me the free switch out. We can take a bubble beam. We can take a bubble beam. Speed fell, so we gotta use mock punch. Okay, we got it, we got it. Oh, he's got more, he's got two more. All right, fine, I'll use a potion. Could you not? Actually, kind of don't like Growl right now because it's reversing all the effort I'm trying to put into Power Up Punch. Okay, good. Last he's got is a Grass type, so free win. All right, I'm gonna do a contest real quick because I gotta see what it's like. Um, I'm gonna put in Monferno, so let's go cool. Cause he's cool. Groove hype points. Oh, this is very different. So I, I maybe I should have done the practice because I uh. Oh, stop! I see. Oh, look! Look at him! He's got the drip. Maybe I should have done some practice, because I don't actually know what I'm doing now. I thought I knew what I was doing, and now I, do I realize that it is very different. Oh, it's a rhythm game. That's different. I was wondering how they were going to do the, uh, the dress-up part, but I guess they're just not. I think I'm winning, though. I have the up arrows, and Starly has the down arrows. Is that the whole thing? Okay, I won. I hope that there is more to it than that. Because that's a little kind of just just a rhythm game. All right, I'll 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 come back to it and we'll see what happens. We'll see what it's like. As of right now, though, we're just going to move on. Oh, Route 209, it's been too long. This is like the nostalgic route theme. Every remix is so great in this game. I love them all. <gasps> Geodude's evolving. I wonder if there's a guy who caught their first Starly on this route. And I want to know what his story is. Oh, how do you do this without tile movement? Well, like that, I guess. It wasn't actually that hard. I do not like the fighting types right now, actually. You know, given my rock type. Not a good thing. I mean, it won't be an issue if I just one-shot everybody, but it's still, you know, we can pretend it's a scary situation. The tall, tall grass. I remember this. Of course, it used to be like dark yellow in the original games. Now it's kind of hard to tell. I remember this route was where I got my first ever shiny Pokemon, and it was a shiny Ponyta. And I think I have it all the way in Gen 8 now. It was a uh, blue ya, because it was blue. Very beautiful, very powerful. Nature is amazing. I mean,. Whatever, she didn't look like she had a smile. The rainy route, where it always rains. Well, I'm not particularly a fan of the rain, being a fire type at all. Like, that would've one shot, but it has to freaking rain! Oh, he's got, he's got type advantage. It's okay, we got this. Dude, we got this. We got this, we can, we can pull through! We can pull through, no! All right. I outspeed, and might one shot, I don't know actually. But I think I can take another Sucker Punch. We got this! Come on! Kill! 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 Yes! Thanks for the fun fight, Ryu. It was a blast.
Surely I don't need to water these, right? I refuse to water those because it's raining. And uh, I'll get back and we'll see if that actually is a thing. Because if it's not, I'll be mad. I remember this ace trainer absolutely destroying me as a kid. And uh, I'm not going to test if that's different now. I'm going to go all the way back and heal. Actually, you know what? No, I got potions. Hey! Hey! That's copyright infringement! What the- Fail! <laughs> Sometimes I get too into the bit and completely forget that I have tried to be PG. Huh. Oh, you have Gyarados! Suddenly I remember why this fight was hard. Alright, alright, we gotta we gotta deal with this now. We're gonna mock punch and we're gonna we're gonna sandstorm. If we sandstorm, the rain goes away, which gives me my fire I get to use my fire moves again, and it also means that the water move isn't gonna one-shot. But also Gyarados probably at speed, so it probably doesn't matter. If I smack down, I could also just potentially combine with with mock punch. I could just kill him outright. I'm willing to do that. I'm willing to try that. Waterfall, who are you hitting? Alright, that's fair. Alright. Yeah. Sucks. I knew there was something I needed to be afraid of with them. So we've got to go on with the strategy. So let's think, what's a good strategy? How about... I do the exact same thing again? And like, hope it works? Like, yeah, that, that makes sense in my head, right? Okay, maybe I'll do one thing different. I'll use Sandstorm. Actually, you know what would be a really good idea? Let's get Glamia out of here now. Um, and get power up punch. So we'll have our attack up. We're gonna try and make it a 2v1. So the only thing that kind of sucks about that is that I no longer have sturdy. Or do I? Uh, if Monferno decides to attack Dwayne this turn, then that kind of sucks. But if he doesn't, then I could heal. Or I outspeed anyways, never mind, it's not even an issue. All right, so Dwayne gets one free turn against Gyarados, guaranteed. Ooh, we're getting damaged this time. We had the power up punch. Okay, he's gonna use it on me, which, yeah, that's the right play. That's the right play. And I'm actually really fine with that because that means I get two smackdowns because I still, I'm still at full HP and I don't even need it. We're good. We did it! See, when you'd only have, like, two Pokémon, the game becomes fun and challenging again. Because I can't just switch to another Pokémon. Isn't there a, uh, arcade? Or, a uh, Gamble. Gamble, Gamble. I want Gamble. Where's Gamble? Wasn't there slots here? It's got the music of it! But this isn't slots! Oh, this is where we go to change our style. But I wanted slots! They took out slots! I'M MAD! <laughs> Hold on, I'm going baby mode. I wanna know why Ryu is roommates with the clown. There's an interesting backstory here and I want to know it. So I still only have two Pokemon because uh, the Pokemon I want I don't get till later. And it's gonna be tough. This is the third gym battle and I still only have two Pokemon, one of which is weak to fighting. Hopefully I can just out damage her with... Cause I'm not weak to... Oh, I might be weak to Metacham. Well, like, I'm super effective against Lucario, and I know Lucario's her ace. Alright, take one, see if we, uh, see if we can actually win with basically one Pokemon. Alright, she's gonna lead with Metatite, which is kind of not what I want to see, because I want a power-up punch, but I'm fine with this. So this isn't one-shotting. I was almost wrong! But hey, if you're gonna use Light Screen, that's fine. I am purely a physical... I guess I have Ember, but I'm not using Ember. But it doesn't mean I can power-up punch. Never mind. All right, I'm cool with that. I just get the flame wheel next turn. All right, that's one down. And we're, we haven't even taken damage. The level up. The low battery. It's all coming together. I'm willing to see what a single flame wheel will do. With just one power up punch. All right, and then I power up punch next turn and he has bulldoze, which is not what you want to see. That's fine. All right, again, the Hyper Potion. Again, I'm okay with that because it lets me get off a, a power-up punch and then I get to Flame Wheel. In fact, I could probably greed for a third power-up punch here because I think it'll kill. And I'm down for that. Okay. I think I could probably one-shot whatever's next with Flame Wheel. It's Lucario, right? So yeah, of course I can. You silly Steel-type! I am a Fire-type with plus three attack! It outspeeds. 
Oh god, it outspeeds. Never mind. I thought I won. I thought I thought we were done. Yeah, I guess I have bulldoze, but uh, yeah, it's not looking great. If it, okay, I have actually wait, wait. We could win this. I don't care about defense because I have sturdy and I'm expecting to get one shot anyways. I won because you can't one shot me and I can now kill you. <laughs> oh, drain punch could screw it over actually if it heals more than I can deal. It, uh, drain punch, don't screw me. Okay, I think I lose. Never mind. Bye. I don't kill. You don't think she hyper potions, do you? What if she uses a hyper potion? If she uses a hyper potion, I won't kill because it'll be at full. But I could heal. Actually, I don't have a way to fully heal myself. Yes, I do. I have the Moo Moo Milk that I randomly bought for no reason. Come on, we can win this. I dare you to use a hyper potion. I dare you. Okay, fine. Yeah, that's game. Maybe it uses Screech and gives me a free turn. Why did I outspeed? Why did I outspeed? I I won! I did it, guys! I, I did it! Da-da! I did it! I, uh, <laughs> deserved to win that. <laughs> the one HP warrior. Hello, Don. I am on the verge of death. Please do not challenge me to a Pokemon battle. All right. I'm gonna end the episode there. Thanks for watching. Uh, two Pokemon. Two Pokemon versus the Royal. Yeah, straight. Let's go. Arms up, pumped. We're pumped. <laughs> oh, whatever. <laughs>